Well, this is going to be a fun engagement. No, because what is it? I think this guy is like, because there's this one guy who's online right now, so it's like, what time is it? I'm looking at my phone. It's like 2, 2 a.m. in the morning. There's this one, this one guy. Oh, I'm going to cough in one second. One sec. <coughs> Sorry. Anyhow. It's like this one guy who's online right now who's like a level like 40, like 42, like 46 or something. It's absolutely insane. He's just going around kicking everyone's butt. As hell. I hope that this, that this is him, essentially. I want revengeance. I want retribution for all, all the injustice. Enemy sighted! Oh, he's just rushing. Engaging engines! Ugh. Launch them. It's clear he's gonna use his battleship at the we end your command. to just do an alpha strike. Ah, oh my god, it's just not fair. Changing course. The enemy has seized a strategic area. Ship ready. Increase the speed. Has seized a strategic area. Course engaged. Setting course. Heading acknowledged. Oh, shit. Orders. Engaging engines. Stay close so he can't fire his torpedoes. Reserve. Acquiring new vector. Target locked in. We wait your command. I have half my fleet. Execute high energy turn. Warning teams have crippled the enemy! Acquiring new vector! Coordinates acknowledged! Your orders? Course engaged! The enemy has accumulated 25% strategic points. Aye, Admiral! We wait your command! <laughs> We won! <laughs> we got it together! Oh my god! We actually beat this guy? We beat this dude. Okay, I want to see if he's like the level 52. I want to see if he's level 52. Okay, he's level 28. Okay, so he's not that high. <laughs> we showed him this twat. No, because this guy just goes around just picking on everyone. So. Because he's just been playing this game non-stop since day one, essentially. And we beat him. We beat the level 28. Take that, Edward. Take that. Actually, he has a very similar fleet to me. Except for, I think, well, he actually... Yeah, he has five. I have five as well. Just that it's... Actually, I don't... 
what is going on? Okay, so he just went full out with that and then upgrade to the Dictator. No, I, I, instead of going with the Dictator, I just went with the Overlord because it had the extra points. Like, you can see here, I think, actually, no. Oh, it's because he got the higher level, I don't know why he would go with the higher level Escort ships. That's the thing, I just went with, um, what is it, Cobras, so. Yeah, no, so his fleet was actually, what is it, we have the same setup, it's just that I had a little better one because of the fact that I had, what is it, I, I guess a, a battle cruiser in the mix, but on top of that, why he failed was because of the fact that he literally sent his fleet there as a diversion or so in order to get his battleship in. And I just hit him with melter torpedoes as he was coming in. Just constantly hitting him. And since he wasn't repairing them, it was literally lowering his ship's morale to the point where when he made contact in that giant mush pit, there was just nothing Nothing you could really do as most of his ships had lost most of the health and the morale and just started to flee and there was nothing you could do about it. And at the end of all that, his entire fleet was basically destroyed and he only had his battleship. Well, I still had, I think, two or three cruisers left that I would have just used to torpedo and ram him to bits, essentially. So yeah, the battle was over, though I'm pretty sure he would have found some sneaky way to try to win or so if he didn't give up. Ah, <sighs> beat this guy, beat this guy. This is a victory.